structure of LED lamps. The manufacture of this ceramic capacitors, NTC thermistors, metal oxide varistors, piezo ceramic buzzers, electronic flashers and high frequency transducers for the different services and organizations such as Bell is specialized by the Keltron Ceramics at Kutipuram in Malapuram district of Kerala. Currently, this unit in Kutipuram is engaged in the building up of infrastructure for the production of hydrophones and active transducers for NPOL. As a part of its diversification plans, the unit has began manufacturing Sanjeevani, an equipment that helps in locating persons stranded underneath heavy debris following earthquakes, landslides and bomb blasts. Also providing guidance for the project works of professional students. Established in 1981, the Keltron complex at Moodadi in Korikod was originally for the manufacture of black and white television sets but moved on to digital transmission equipment in 1992. Currently, the unit is engaged in the manufacture of card assemblies using SMT machines for organizations such as Bell, BHEL, ISRO, KEL Kundra Unit, United Electricals Kerala and other private organizations. This unit is engaged in making card assemblies used in energy meter. Originally focused on the manufacture of pneumatic actuators and control instrumentation is the Keltron controls at Arur in Alapura. As a part of diversification, this unit in Alapura has also moved into the manufacture of equipment that the defense services and organizations such as Bell, the National Physical and Oceanographic Laboratory require. The unit also has a computer assembly division and another division for manufacture of movement aids for the physically challenged. This initiative taken by Keltron shows its presence in the social arena and its responsibility towards society. Yet another initiative in which Keltron has high stakes is the Keltrack a joint venture of the central and state governments. It is engaged in fabrication work of ISRO and also has a center for imparting training in tool and die making. Besides being at the forefront of manufacturing technologies, Keltron is also focused on systems and software development and offers some of the most innovative, career-relevant courses under its IT business group. Keltron's IT education and training program reflects the latest development in networking technologies. It has also been imparting and assisting a whole new generation to secure gainful employment by imparting training in fashion design, fire safety, animation, multimedia, hardware, networking, advanced software programming and software testing and embedded system designing. It is also providing the infrastructure for the tool and die making course conducted by NTTF. Several new software have been developed at the Vela Emblem campus of Keltron which is the IT business group division of Keltron that provides IT hardware and servicing for various government departments. Several new software have been developed at the Vela Emblem campus of Keltron.
Keltron has been playing a major role in ensuring the security of major national institutions such as the Indian Parliament with its surveillance equipment. It has provided surveillance solutions on a very large scale basis to the government of Kerala and is in the process of offering similar equipment and services to other states. The surveillance cameras have been installed by Keltron in the central jails of Pujapura and Kannur, also in the Secretariat of the State. A 2,000 strong workforce spread over its different units across Kerala and marketing outlets in different parts of India, Keltron's strength lies in its highly skilled multidisciplinary team of professional managers and skilled workforce with a proven track record in complex precision manufacturing. Of the total workforce, 400 are engineers who possess extensive, hands-on experience in technology integration and adoption, high-tech manufacturing operations and in management of ambitious turnkey projects. Keltron is extremely thankful to the government for the support extended through frequent review meetings. Riding on the liberal support being extended by the government of Kerala and its own internal resource mobilization, Keltron is racing ahead towards its cherished goal of becoming the first public sector enterprise in Kerala to record an annual turnover of rupees 1000 crore, a giant leap from the rupees 225 crore turnover recorded during 2009-2010. Keltron, the green PSU of Kerala, is more focused than ever on leveraging its 37 years of experience for the development and manufacture of defense equipment, security and surveillance systems, intelligent traffic control and management systems, power electronic systems, process automation systems, information technology solutions, electronic components, identity card solutions, aerospace applications and execution of electronics and information technology based projects using the latest knowledge in the relevant technological domains. Keltron has entered into agreements with the country's premier defense research organizations such as the National Physical and Oceanographic Laboratory and the Defense Research and Development Organization Keltron has set up dedicated research and development centers at its Arur and Karakulam units to develop new products based on cutting-edge technology. Its research and development wing has won laurels for its premium products such as electromagnetic logs used in ships and submarines, echo sounders and underwater telephones, sonar arrays such as Ushas, Nagin and Marich, modern processor-based ground mines, security and surveillance system, attendance and access control management system and intelligent transport management system. Keltron's history is a saga of innovation in electronics. From being a pioneer in 1973 to the role of a trendsetter today, Keltron has been the catalysis for the development of electronics industry not only in Kerala but also in the whole of India. It has transformed the capital city of Kerala, Thiruvananthapuram, into one of the electronic hubs of the country. Keltron has triggered a revolution that keeps churning out its benefits 
to individuals and institutions in different parts of the world, continuing in its quest to innovate products and processes that would add further value to life and to the industry.